My name is Lily McBride. Um, I used to work with WAVE as operations director. Um, I've, in my professional career, I've mostly worked with professional artists or musicians in some capacity. Um, I'm also a musician myself. I play harp and I sing and I compose. Um, yeah, I work for an art gallery now in Columbus and that's me. Yeah, so that was my first time facilitating a workshop. Um, it was really cool. like our first meeting, I was super excited. A lot of parents came, a lot of kids came. And it kind of ended up only being one kid that stuck through the whole workshop, Kamarion. Um, but it was kind of amazing because he was just so spirited and just brought 150% energy every time. He was so excited about playing instruments, so excited about just kind of sharing his viewpoints. Um, was really excited to show his mom um, and his little brother. It was really special in a way just to be able to work with one kid because that's not very common that our workshops just work with one person. So um, I feel like we got to know him really well. And, you know, the song spoke to him definitely, but I feel like even that one or two workshops we had with more participants, he still kind of touched on some of their stories and their feedback. So that was pretty special. Grant was amazing. I think he's just a natural at working with people, honestly. He's just very warm very easy to talk to and I think Grant had a really great way of just like bringing him back to like his interests and kind of making sure that he felt heard and felt seen and felt respected which I think is really important for kids because I think a lot of times you know kids are like oh you're cute but like what you're saying doesn't really matter you know that's like what they get from adults a lot of time and I think wave in general like that's something that we're really passionate about is just making kids feel heard and making them feel like their voices matter and um Grant definitely like exemplified that and he just made an amazing song that brought in so much of what Kamarion, you know, said in sessions and it was, I mean, it was really cool because, I mean, this, what makes a good songwriter in these workshops especially is like, you're not just like, give me a lyric and I'll put it in this song. It's like, you pull things out of these conversations and so there were things that weren't directly about the music or about the song that Kamarion would just say kind of like offhandedly or like in another context and Grant like remembered that and just like put it in the song in really subtle ways. Um, so like he really captured, I think, a lot of Kamarion's personality and his, you know, his voice, which is cool. And I feel like he did such an amazing job of creating like a happy song that makes you like feel something and makes you feel like, yeah, like life is good and it's gonna get better and like things are important, things matter, like, I don't know. I literally, every time I think of that song, it gets stuck in my head for like days. And I'm not even mad about it, because I'm just like... I mean, I think, you know, similar to Grant, I think she... She came in with just such an open mind, and, um, you know, I think she's worked with a lot of different groups before, so she's done, I think, similar things to this workshop before, but... Um, you know, we told her like that, that was fairly early on, you know, because it's kind of a condensed workshop where we just met twice a week for like four weeks instead of like over a longer period. So at that point we're like, there might be like eight people, there might just be a couple and it was just Kamarion <laughs> that came and she just like, it didn't phase her at all. She was just like, great, like let's make artwork together. You know, she brought a bunch of magazines. We kind of just all collaged with her. Uh, I think Shelly was in that session too. Um, and so it was just really fun, like she just, again, just like really listened to him and like really like asked him about what colors he liked, asked him why he was picking picking the pictures that he did for the collage. It was just like kind of a um, like meditative day. It was like we got to make art and talk to Marianne, meet April a little bit. So that was really fun.